In today's video, we will talk about preparing cash flow diagrams using Microsoft Project. In order to be able to create a cash flow diagram, make sure that the necessary resources are assigned to each activity in your project schedule. For example, if I drag this to the right here, I will have the resource name and their associated costs. Once you make sure that you have a resource assigned for all of the project activities, then you go to Report, and from there, you click the Cost Report and click on Cash Flow. This report will be generated for you. Beside the cash flow diagram here, the cost variance, remaining cost, baseline cost, and actual cost till date are given in the report. As you can see in here, the costs are given based on quarters. But since we have a small project, we want to see these costs based on days or maybe weeks. To achieve that, click on the chart and then from here we will select time and the next thing is to edit our horizontal axis. From the units we will select days and the next thing is to click OK. Before we click OK, here is something given the name of count. Right now we have selected one which means that the cash flow diagram will be shown based on each single day of your project. But if you increase it, for example, to two or three, your cash flow charts will be given every three days. I'll select three and click OK. Furthermore, from the fields in here, we can add other elements as well, for example, actual cost. You can further modify the cash flow diagram here in the Microsoft project or you can copy and paste it in Microsoft Excel and do the further formatting. For example, for the actual cost, I want to change the chart type to columns. I'll right click and change series chart type. From here, I will select columns and click OK. We can copy this and paste it to Microsoft Excel. For example, in Microsoft Excel, I want to remove the vertical axis. Next thing is, for example, let's do a bit of formatting with the colors and remove these lines from here. And next thing is to change the color of this line. For example, let's come to fill in lines, select solid fill and select color from here. Next thing is to change the color of these bars. Let's go to format. From here we will select the fill for the fill solid fill. We will select a dark blue color for these ones and next thing is to make the chart itself a little bit bigger so it can appear very clear on our dashboards. And let's add the data labels. So this is how you can prepare a cash flow diagram using Microsoft Project. If you found the content of the video informative, don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel and follow our Instagram and LinkedIn pages for more useful content about project management. Thank you very much for watching.